I got into pharmaceutical sales, worked in hospitals. It was really great, very lucrative, made good money, traveled around, very fun job. And then after like three years, I was like one of their top reps. In my very early 20s, I had just finished my first master's and they laid me off. And it was the weirdest experience because they like kicked us out basically of the building. Like first they we went in, nobody, you know, nobody was expecting anything and then you were just there for a normal day of work and then they called you all to the human resource office and one by one you go in there as if like you're in big trouble, like you did something wrong and they pretty much gave you a severance package and said you, you don't work here anymore. We have we, we can't, you know, fulfill your position and then security escorts you out of the building and it's like <laughs> humiliating. Yeah. And it's like, wow, I didn't even do anything wrong. I'm one of your best people. And it, that was in 08. Um, so obviously the market had taken a huge dump, for better words. And, you know, they needed to lay a lot of people off. So I was one of those people. And thank God it happened in my early 20s because I was watching people in their 50s being laid off. Like, at, I was walking out, I was like 22, but people were like 56 and 58. And they were devastated. And that was they didn't know what other income they were going to have after that and some of them were going nuts screaming and crying and it was like awful to see i didn't understand it but i think that situation caused me to then become an entrepreneur